Hello and welcome back! We are finally heading to the Temple of the Elk, or maybe the technically the encampment. I don't know. So many good options here. And finally, we are well rested, so we can go there. Um, I don't know. Let's go to the Temple of the Elk. Might as well do it. Let's see if someone's here. <clears throat> Oh yeah, certain spells and abilities have permanent effects. Permanent blindness, that does not mean they can be removed or cured, or that they don't have a fixed duration. Oh yeah, but I have five characters, none of them can remove the blindness that I have on myself. Not on myself actually, on Valerie and Lindsay. But yeah, it's a concern. <clears throat> We found the right trail. The ritual was held here, but be careful. There are dangerous beasts ahead. I like how you look. They are both guards of this place and tokens of the druid's evil magic. Please be careful. <clears throat> Got it. I won't be halted. Oh, this is a rather small place. Primal no, giant frog. Uh oh. That's that's sing. Oh yeah, yeah, actually we have the summon beast there. Oh yeah. I like it. What? We can't loot them. Okay, that, this place is not as dangerous as we thought. What is going on in the middle? The muddy water gives off a strange, nauseating smell and emits the tattered fog. Oh, we found the source of the problem. Uh-oh. Seems like a doable uh, challenge for us. Oh, that's nice. How did you? That's so much. That was a max roll. Okay, well, that was all my spells. Lindsay, what's called for? <gasps> Some doggies, they could their stuff. Oh, they don't have Onwards. anything. Okay, let me guess. Another group of animals who hate my guts over here. To victory! Run them through! I hurt. Oh, look at that. Some board. I lead. You follow. Snake. What can you tell me about this? Oh, look at that. Stag man. We do it my way. Hmm. Cut them to pieces. What is that? Earl like tree. A bear like tree. In. Damage reduction. Oh! Unworthy. He's talk he's, he's fighting Tristan! We gotta go in right now! I see your light. Sing! <laughs> Tristan, get up! That was a tough fight. What you got, bear? What? I was just about to uh, note that <clears throat> the game cares so much about realistic loot in in the in, in all the enemies and somewhat containers, but now 
We found a, a tree bear with meat in it. And we skinned it for its pelt. Okay. I know about DR. So, no need to tell me about that. Kristen, I'm sorry, but I have priorities. Ooh. It's over here. Is that just a... Nah, uh, that's, that's not a thingy to climb down. Give me that. Okay, we got it all. I won't be <clears throat> halted. Hey, there, Tristan. That looks like a bow. Stop. I swear, never have I been so glad to meet a stranger. Even with the power granted me by Saren Ray, I almost lost. Saren Ray. You have my thanks. Please, allow me to introduce myself. My name is Tristian. I'm just gonna call you Tristan. <clears throat> known to, her, known to her faithful as the. Downflower, Saren say, the healing light, the everlight. Saren Ray is a goddess who teaches temperance and patience in all things. Compassion and peace are her greatest virtues. And if enemies of the faith can be redeemed, they should be. Worship of this goddess of healing, honesty, redemption, and the sun began far to the east of the inner sea, in the vast Adisha Empire of the of Kalash. But her worshippers can now be found throughout the world. Okay. A Saren Ray fanatic. Talk about people I'd be just as happy not seeing for the next <laughs> thousand years. <laughs> Come on, be friendly. You're wounded. Do you need aid? How do you get here? A local nymph directed me here. She thinks the enhanced enchanted fog. And this temple was created by the druid who served the bandit leader here. I expect defeating the beast guards should cut the fog clear. That's optimistic of you, dude. I have never spoken to nymphs, but I believe their assessment is accurate. The creatures occupying this temple are far from ordinary animals. The power that moved them here is related to the fog. The beasts hold the fog as anchors hold a ship dancing in the waves. From what I can tell, once the beasts are defeated, the fog should begin to clear. So what now? Praised be Saren Ray. Now, if my knowledge serves, the fog should weaken and eventually clear entirely. We need only wait. <laughs> Perhaps somewhere more hospitable? Do you need help? You are very kind. Kindness to strangers is in short supply these days. But worry not. Saren Ray's priests are skilled in the healing arts. I can heal myself. Can you heal me? How did you get here? I was investigating this fog. I believe you have already discerned that it is magical in nature. I serve Saren Ray, goddess of sunlight. Discovering an evil magic that isolated living creatures from the sun alarmed me in no small way. I was able to locate the place the fog originated from, but was too presumptuous and almost got into the beast's teeth. Come with me, man! I need healing! With those beast deaths, I have uh, other matters to attend to. Farewell. Please join me. Please wait. Oh, yes. You saved my life. I have no treasures or relics, yes. but I have knowledge and the divine power of a priest. Uh. I wish to aid you in your journeys. I don't need your help. Fuck off. Just kidding. Please come with me. Uh, sure. I would welcome your assistance. Thank you. I hope I will be of help. I really hope that it... The... Uh, Confide in me. Wait, what? He's level three. Automatically, he's leveled up. So I'm not leveling him up, which is a bit of a bummer. Extend spell. It's a skilled human, by looks of it. Treat affliction. It wouldn't work, right? State your desire. That's not an affliction we can treat. 
I'm listening. Anyway, back to this new guy. What do you have? A uh, touch of God. So first of all, what the fuck is that? What's on? Ecclesiastes Turge. Character? No, I know what a character class is. This is. Is he some kind of a cleric? I guess. Yeah, he looks like a spellcaster. Basically like a different cleric, right? Selective channel. Wait, does he have spells? Okay, he has domain slots. And uh, he has to exactly select. So he's like a cleric. Yeah, I no. The cleric has spontaneous casting, doesn't it? I don't fucking know now. <laughs> anyway. Protection from evil. Cure light wounds. Fire belly. Well, we can't really replace his spells anyway. Maybe I'm just gonna give this uh maybe I'm just gonna run over these spells a little bit. More in detail on my own. Wait, level two? Holy crap, we have level two already? Because everyone has that? No. Only he has it. What a bastard. Of course he's like a... So this is like a fighter mage. This is like a... Like, this is like a mixed character, but this is like a... More of a caster. Precaster level. Or I'm, I'm wrong? I don't know. So, here we have Cure Moderate Wounds and Protection from Alignment. Full strength. Enhancement boost to strength. So we can just click, just just select anything. Uh, we can also check his alignment, his neutral good. Uh, I'm not sure if he has any alignment restrictions. Also, it's pretty likely that uh, we're not gonna be able to change his alignment. If he just doesn't like my stuff, he's just gonna leave. Or maybe just not say anything. But we not, won't be able to change him. Oh, good. Spell book. So, let's check this out. Protection from alignment, blast, shield of fate, protection from evil. I don't think we're gonna be ever charging. Blessing of faithful, long. As a standard action, the... Less it... Turge can bless one ally within close range. A blessed ally gains two sacred bonus on attack rolls, skill checks, ability checks, saving throws, and two AC until the, the classic, classic Turge's nectar, next turn. The uh, Echoes Turge. What is this word? I, I'm terrible. Can expand uh, one use of channel energy when activating this ability to increase the duration. Okay, okay, okay. I, I got it. But isn't this better? Channel positive energy heal living? But that's that's just a party heal. That's just one friendly creature. You can touch a creature as a standard action, granting secret bonus to attack rolls, skill checks, ability checks. Saving throws. What is this? A standard action. Oh, that's the blessing again. That's short. That's long. But this doesn't... Oh, yeah. It's very short. Uh, but... It, this can be used as a, like a, the minor. Uh, bonus for a brief time. Okay. Uh, welcome. No! I know what we're gonna do. I got some papers. Can you read these? Uh, uh, you'll have to show me how to use it first. Whatever. Put the papers over there. You. Look at these papers. 
Oh, he has one already? Oh my god. Perfect. How may I help? Use the papers. I'm pretty sure we cannot select uh, a way to... I'm pretty sure he doesn't have access to uh, a blind removal yet, right? He will have access to it eventually. Not yet. See invisibility. I quite like clerics actually. If you're willing to put up with the the slight alignment restriction, and then it's a very strong. Uh, I don't know. Actually, I don't know if if it's strong at all here, but like it should be a pretty versatile. Your moderate wounds. Okay. What we can do is just try to, at least try to use the, the remove blindness. It should not require us to make a magic. Yeah, it works. What about this new guy? So he does not even have a fucking armor on, which is just a dead giveaway that he's a noob. Oh my god! I sold all my armor! What about my... Use that. Quarter staff plus one. Well, um... It would be nice now. I'm pretty sure that he can only use light armor. Or no, he might be able to use medium armor. Although I'm not sure because this is a unique class. Abilities. He's a humane, a uh, human. Spontaneous healing. Uh, chosen of Seren Ray. Not what we want. I'm looking for his uh, feats. Mm. Nah, that's not what I want. But he's not proficient with any type of armor or shield. He cannot even use light armor. That's insane. Okay. This guy. What is that? So that is the formation we're going with. This guy is just gonna stay back. Uh, the only reason he's staying close to the party... Is because we might be able to defend him this way. If if we're gonna run into some ranged opponents, well, it's gonna suck. I don't know. He's kind of boring. I'm pretty boy, cleric, or he has a stupid word for a cleric. Blessed Turch. Yeah. Well, we gotta go away. But we have finally full party, and that's pretty good. And uh, I'm not sure. Why he's auto leveled, because I'm pretty sure by the difficulty or by my preference, like he should not be auto leveled, because that just means that when we find characters later, it's it's more likely that we're gonna find the character. Well, especially because how the by what the game thinks is good, it's very likely that we're gonna find the character that's piece of garbage because uh, it really matters what kind of feat you, feats you picked up. You cannot stand against me. Unworthy. Oh, what? One skeletal champion. I really hope we can take him out. Yeah. Last time we fought one, it didn't go well. Even right now, it's not going so well. Come on, one skeletal champion. A single one. Here I am. I'm listening. 
I mean, loot him. Breastplate. So, even if I took these, it would not help me whatsoever. Because that guy cannot wear I armor. Won't be halted. Pretty disappointing. No armor whatsoever? How the hell did he survive against that bear? Actually, no, he was he was killed. Well, he wasn't killed, he, he, he was on the ground. Wizards, Magi, and Elder Scoundrels. Okay. That's the advantage of, uh, like, clerics. You just have access to everything. You don't have to mess around with learning all the spells. Okay. Lighting! I require... No! Rest again? Ah, uh, sure. Let's rest. No! We got the new guy! There's someone on the road. Get ready. Or get what, something. Each of your companions has a favorite food recipe. Cooking that recipe at camp will grant that companion a useful temporary bonus effect. Sure. I mean... I'm trying to... Uh... Get get a soup going for like two months now, for and Gora! even that is uh, not really happening. I'm not about to start uh, anything dif Repent. anything more difficult. This looks uh, uh, a little bit tricky. Can I just do a uh, heal everybody? It's worth. This, this seems like an amazing skill. Oh. You forced my hand. The cleric is, is extremely powerful. I'm hungry. Nah, I don't care. They have nothing. I just leave. I just wanna rest. Really? Clark is insane. I don't know. But if we get that dwarf, if we have the chance to get that dwarf in our team that I don't know the name of, uh, we're gonna do that. Because that dwarf had character. This guy doesn't have character. Wait. What kind of skills you got? Can't really help with hunting. Only plus nine. Pathetic. Camp camouflage. Recipe. Hearty meal. Help me with the cooking, okay? Um, uh, let's. Well, actually, well, let's do it. That's it. Sure. But at least we are arrested. Actually, no. Go this way. Oh, look at that! The Technic League encampment. Rest at Oleg's trading post at your capital. Heal crippled characters. At my capital? The heals... Ripples? Okay. Just, uh, my limb regenerates. But I need to use a scroll to remove the blindness. Hmm... What's over here? 
Hey, Bonnie. Pretty small place. I won't be halted. The problem is we, we won't be able to kick out this guy. If I even if I wanted to. To victory. Lana. Serves you right. We shouldn't waste a lot of time with that swordsman. We can go and get Kalana. Now finally, we're getting the range characters. Oh. Strength. Look at that. <clears throat> Kalana drops her weapon and raises her hands, which are covered in blood. Mercy! Don't kill me! Oh, look at that. The half orc bears his fangs. That is how you talk now, wretch. I wanted to do this for a l so long. Cast a spell on his uh, outstretched palm. Sparks begin dancing upon it. The half elf puts her hand on his shoulder. Argongar, come up, come now, let her go. It's wanting to kill her in battle, but executing her unarmed might spoil the joy of being free. <clears throat> Octavia, are you out of your mind? This filth is from the Technic League. By her own hand, she enchained us. And you want to forgive her? Do you think she'll thank you? Ha! She'll just get her another band and try to catch us again. Before deciding her fate, I want to ask some questions. Why? I'll spare her life, go back to Numeria. No way! It's the right thing to punish your tormentor, kill her, Rigonger. That's lawful neutral. This thing. She pissed me off. I will finish her myself. <laughs> As the future lawful ruler of these lands, I intend to instate public executions. <laughs> Oh. Right thing to do. Before deciding her fate, I want to ask some questions. I'll tell you everything. I, I know much. You'll see. I'm more used to you alive than dead. Is it normal for the Technic League to grab random people from the road and enslave them? Ah, the, the Technic League is so strong because it is never ashamed of taking what it needs. Whatever the laws may say, we are missing a slave. We underestimated you. That was a mistake, of course. I apologize. So, you're sorry that I was stronger than you. What are you doing in this part of the world? I was sent by Maestro Janus. He's a very important person and a mighty wizard, who taught these two ungrateful slaves everything they know. You will be furious to find out they are free, and will certainly find one who stole the Technic League's property. Believe me, he does not need me for that. Whether you kill me or not, he will find you in no time. You say this Magistro guy of yours will find us anyway, but I guess we don't need anything of... out of sparing you. <clears throat> you best not anger the Maestro. If you kill me, he'll be furious. Oh, I'm so scared, you know. I actually like getting slaves and other assholes angry with me. Then I... Slavers and other assholes angry with me. Then I get to cut them to pieces. Why did you have to... Why did you have these two in chains? <clears throat> because we own them. The Technic League spent vast sums of money on these two. We nurtured them, fed and treated them. Even taught them magic for many years. They cost us a fortune. If we're not going to just set them free, whatever your local customs say, they're full in our rights. I don't have more questions. Listen to me. Don't make any hasty decisions. I'm an important person in the Technic League. I have connections. You will benefit from such an ally. <clears throat> Sparing a repentant sinner is a good deed, but I hear no repentance in her words. She seeks impunity, not mercy. Tristan... 
Okay, you're not the dumbest. You see, now what a slime ball she is. Step aside, let me fry her. It's uh it's a right thing to punish your tormentor. Kill her, the gonger. Uh, I, I can go with that. She pissed me off. Uh, no, no, no. As much as she pissed me off, I think she definitely pissed Regongar off more. I'm not gonna do it because it's lawful. Because, like, it, it's gonna give me more of a pleasure that someone who has a bigger bone to pick with her uh, actually kills her. I'll spare her life. Go back to Numeria. No way. Piss me up now. I don't know. Lawful neutral. Regongar strikes Kalana across the face. Get out of my cell, you filth. Thank the gods that my friends are so soft. Wait, what? What's no way? I told you to kill her. <sighs> you shouldn't have spared her life. Second thought, what difference does it make? Either way, you're rot in the abyss. I clicked on the wrong button, didn't I? Oh, man. <clears throat> ha! We're free. I can't believe it. Free as the birds in the sky. Phew! Ha <laughs> ha Regongar holds Activia tight. And she laughs uh, lightly and kisses him on the lips. Thank you. You have no idea how long we tried to escape the technical... This is a miracle. Who are you? I haven't time for games with you die. That's, that's crazy. Who are you? I'm Regongar. This is Octavia. The rotten Numerian held us slaves. Held us as slaves. But we are no mere scavenger. You see the crowd they had guarding us? It's because we use magic. And I'm not bad with a blade. If it comes to that. They're alright. We could use them on our team. <laughs> My thoughts exactly. What is technically? We know that. How did you get captured by Kalana? You're good fighters. Want to join my group? There's something we discuss. We have to discuss. Go to Alex Trading Post. You'll be safe there. Uh, yeah. You want to join my group? Of course. Octavia, what do you say? I would be happy to join. What do we have here? I can't. I can't do it now. Can Can I do it now? Bell strike. I'm not sure. I don't think I can do it. Let's just do the group manager. So we would have to go back to the Oleg camp. We put in, put in these guys. Oh, we're taking that. We do it my way. Oh yeah, yeah. Sure, let's take that. Oh yeah, three prisoners. Freedom! Onwards! I didn't wanna let Kalana go. You misclicked. I failed. I'm sorry. Oh, it's not gonna happen. Yeah. Okay. Scroll of Bane. I lead. You follow. Maybe we should go toward Oleg's trading post. Not right now, though. Definitely not right now. And Lindsay was called for it. Yes. Yes. Share your trade. Should I just do this? This is so crazy good. Like, this is like nothing compared to it. Something bothering you? Okay. Player can heal like insane amounts. There's nothing here that I really care about. Uh, I'll just go. <clears throat> Okay, so I have two new companions, but uh, by the looks of it, they are not companions that have stories.
because they didn't talk. They don't have uh, they don't have a voice. The characters I have in the party have a voice, but the ones those ones didn't have a voice. I'm not sure if they are. I suppose I can explain or just uh, talk about this easiest by uh, bringing up Pillars of Eternity 2. Uh, there the game has mercenaries. Uh, they are just, you just like hire them, they are muscle. The game has uh, full story companions. Uh, that like really take part in the story. Like they are basically what you expect from companions. But also the game has like, uh, like I don't know. Uh, semi story companions that maybe have a look they are more than mercenaries, but they are definitely not like story companions But more than mercenaries also you don't get to customize them So I think that's what's going on here Those characters don't seem to well at least they don't have voice acting so At least uh, their opening lines weren't voice acted them and I'm pretty sure May like we if... have a moment of respite? Wait, what? You want to rest? If, if those were not voice acted, then there's a pretty good chance that uh, nothing will be voice acted. Okay. But the question is, like... Is, is there voice, act uh, voice acting missing? But other than that... They are full characters, full story characters, or what's going on? Because I don't know. I think I'm gonna uh, look it up. Tusk better lair. We gotta do that. So we're gonna go there. Come on, avoid the enemies. Evade them. We're going to the Tusk Gutter Lair, but also we are very furrow. Oh yeah, this is the way. May we have a moment of respite? Moment of respite again? What the hell is up with that guy? I... Hmm. I can't I can't can't really make heads or tails of it. Did I, did I spend so much time running around that we need to rest again? No, he is the one that needs the rest. Everybody else is fine, and actually, it doesn't matter that he needs I the rest. He's useless. So here we are. The monster is here, and now I tear him apart. Just watch me. Wait for her to continue. There's a custom where I'm from. A boy kills a monster in front of the elders. Prove he's a man. In, in our tribe. Girls don't get no initiation at all, so I arranged my trial myself. Like in the song about Kagul the orphan, I downed the cave lion in a, in a single combat. Here, see the scars I got in the battle? And do you know what my elders did after I threw the lion skin at their feet? <clears throat> I'm just gonna let you finish. They laughed in my face. They said I scratched my belly myself and hired some men to kill the lion for me, in trade for... Ugh. Later they agreed my initiation, of course. They had no choice, but... Attack Tusgutter. I see, come. The battle, where is it Tusgutter? Leave Tusgutter's lair. A fight like this require some pen preparation, does it? Must you really slay him in single combat? I'll take... It'll take our whole party to bring this Tusgutter down. I never heard anything more stupid. We won't waste our time in your silly rituals. I don't wanna disrespect her, but this is not about. This is not about. This is about the party. Even if you can kill this Tusgutter on your own, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. We go together and uh, we do everything together. It's easiest that way. We're already here. Must you really slay him in a single combat? It'll take our whole party to bring this Tusgutter down. Just... You know, it will make me feel better. Bah, you think I can butcher a pig by myself? Though, if the elders saw the beast 
was about to kill the boy, they would help him. There's no shame in that. But it doesn't matter. I'm just saying. Now you stand and watch me gutting the beast. I see. Come on to battle. Watch me. With a battle cry, the barbarian cha charges for the boar. I'm going along, got it. You're going alone, but we are about to help you out. I don't know. I'm just I'm just here to watch it. Unworthy. I believe in you, Miri. We are just observing from a safe distance. Out of my way. Come finish it off. We're coming. Oh crap. I always survive. Good job. You got him lucky hit though. You don't have to prove how tough you are. Uh oh. Come on, take it out. <clears throat> Breathing heavily, Amiri stands over the corpse of the fallen monster. What you say? See me in action? I almost chuffed his head off. Yeah, but you gotta be more careful. You don't have to prove anything to me, Amiri. Yes! A real epic battle, just like the sagas. I wouldn't even have to embellish it for the book. That's it! Trial done! Now no one dares to say Amiri is weak. You're a valiant warrior. Were there truly fools who doubt your strength? Some did, you know. I spit on them. No one will dare bark at me now. Are you hurt? Well, I just not that. Still, why don't you want to kill this monster? Why do you want to kill this monster? You passed this test back when you were with your tribe, didn't you? Well, not just pups must pass this test. If a man is newcomer to the tribe, he must bring a monster's hide. Proves he's not weak. Okay, I see. I'm honored you consider me part of your new tribe. You're a strong and a valiant warrior. Oh boy. Are you embarrassed? I didn't think you were capable of that. Mm, I don't like this whole tribe idea. I only help you. You owe me nothing. Well... I'm kinda... Mm, well, I'm gonna honor her, her ways. That's okay. I'm honored you consider me part of your new tribe. I like that. I want this like a... Uh, Family thing going on here. More than friends. Or like at least friends. Or at least, at least more than just uh, mercenaries looking for a, a paycheck. That, that could get ugly. Just don't start with that. Don't talk to me about honor and valor. I know already. Still, I owe you thanks. You have a true chief's heart. Ah. You know what? If we meet another monster like this, I'll kill it too. Not just for a test. Just, just that nobody would ever dare say Amiri isn't the warrior. <laughs> All right. Tusk got her down. Beyond Dead is such a frivolous town. I prefer immortal, eternal, everlasting. We do it my way. Oh. May we have a moment of respite? No! Are we taking that? Taking it all. And let's go. Wait, what? He had some loot? Onwards! Oh. Warned about fighting traps? What about that? The honey. I lead. You follow. Sure. I'm gonna eat that, I guess. 
Amiri, that's yours. What a picture of Amiri. <gasps> Demons. Demons and devils are three different types of something something that I couldn't read in time. Okay, let's see. So we did a good one here. We cleared out this area. We can go back to all trading post, but maybe we shouldn't. We are making progress. I like that. I like that quite a bit. I'm not sure how should I really explore the land. Should I focus on the main points of interest? I can't even go this way. I, I don't know. Riverine rise. That's the only point of interest we know about. And it's gonna take us uh, uh, quite some time to get there. And we don't have any other uh, headquarters. Uh, like the Olex trading post. <clears throat> anyway guys, that's it for now. Thanks for watching and see you next time.